AM 970 KCFO is the place to be every afternoon for the Dave Ramsey Show and the Dr. Lara program. Dave Ramsey from 1 to 4 p.m. Monday through Friday. They caused their own problem by lending people money that shouldn't have been lent money. And then it's Dr. Lara, 4 to 6. You're calling to get me to change her arguing, and I can't get you to change you. Dave Ramsey and Dr. Laura afternoons on AM 970 KCFO and online at KCFO.com. Let's face it, most of the items on our to-do list aren't usually much fun. I bet this guy would agree. But we've got one sticky note for you with some good news, and here it is. Pick up this month's issue of Community Spirit. It's available in churches, restaurants, and other businesses all over Tulsa, Bigsby, Broken Arrow, Jinx, Claremore, and Owasso. It's fun. It's uplifting. It's even free. Community Spirit Magazine, the magazine for the Christian community. You're going to love it. Dynamic Audio, Tulsa's newest destination for your home audio and video needs. Specializing in custom integration and control of lighting, heat and air, and security for your home. From system design to installation, Dynamic Audio will walk you through each step of any size project. At Dynamic Audio, we provide what people desire most, customer service and a buying experience like no other. We invite you to come by and see for yourself what our existing clients are already talking about. Located at 101st and Yale in the shops of Seville. Welcome back. You're watching Life in Tulsa. And as you can tell, we're having a great time here. Still more to come. Of course, the University of Tulsa right here in our own hometown. And we're going to talk with Athletic Director Bubba Cunningham when we come back. It's time for the year-end clearance sale at Primo Kia. Every vehicle in stock has been priced for immediate sale. They all come with Kia Motors, 10-year, 100,000-mile limited warranty, and Primo Kia's checkbook of savings. This 09 Optima, loaded, just $15,997. Register now for the Primo Kia Club. Win prizes every month and a grand prize of a 2010 new Kia. Kia, the power to surprise. Primo Kia surprises every day, 4747 South Yale. The most changing terrain in America surrounds the urban vibrations of Tulsa. Visit TravelOK.com. Oklahoma, Native America. AM 970 KCFO is the place to be every afternoon for the Dave Ramsey Show and the Dr. Lara program. Dave Ramsey from 1 to 4 p.m. Monday through Friday. They caused their own problem by lending people money that shouldn't have been lent money. And then it's Dr. Lara, 4 to 6. You're calling to get me to change her arguing, and I can't get you to change you. Dave Ramsey and Dr. Lara, afternoons on AM 970 KCFO and online at KCFO.com. One of the great things about life in Tulsa is football. We're sitting here on the 40-yard line at the University of Tulsa, and let me tell you, they are getting ready for an exciting upcoming home game. With us right now is Bubba Cunningham, the athletic director. Tickets still available for games, right? Yep, we have season tickets available, individual game tickets available. We just hope that uh, all of the Sooner fans, the Cowboy fans, when they're not headed to their alma mater, they'll come here and watch a great hurricane football. That's awesome. You know, I was talking with Coach Graham, and one thing that really impressed me about him is that he's not just interested in how the boys play football, but also their mindset that they're doing well in school, that, you know, the, the ethics and the morals are there. And I, I love, as a mom, I love hearing that. Yeah, you know, he had a rough upbringing himself. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, his father ran out on his, his, his mother, and so his mom raised him, and his coach was central in his life. So mm -hmm. the coaching role in Todd's mind is much more than a football coach, and he has done an awful lot for these young men. And I think it really, it's, it's so genuine that in the recruiting process, it comes through very, very well to parents. And uh, I think that's why some of these kids have chosen to come and be a part of his program. Besides the, what I used to call a dorm, you know, these, these football players are living in 
awesome apartments here on campus. It's great. Yeah, the, the student housing has been tremendous. All of the uh, students on campus as a freshman have to live in dormitories, which mm -hmm. all the student athletes do. But your sophomore year and after, then you can live in the apartments. And I had a group of friends in from El Paso recently and just kind of swelled with pride about how the whole place has changed. They couldn't believe the apartments. They couldn't believe the Collins administration building. Just the look of the new Chapman Commons. It's, it's a spectacular campus. So we're really a small private university. I think we were kind of a small private commuter college and we've really changed the university in the last couple of years. Well certainly the landscape has changed when you drive by. Um, I know it's a team sport but can you tell us about some of the players that you are expecting big things from this year? Well I think that's really something for Coach Graham to do but it is a team sport mm -hmm. and I think that that's one thing I like about college athletics and like about football in particular. You know, you can be the quarterback, you can be the offensive lineman, the re receiver, a defender, but everybody's so critical to success. And trying to get 100 people on the same page with 10 coaches, and it, it's kind of like a military operation, but it's, uh, it's very strategic, but it, everyone appreciates the role of all the other players because if someone doesn't do their job, you're not going to be successful. And we've been talking about in on our TV show, Life in Tulsa, this whole social media phenomenon. People can actually follow um, Tulsa football. They can go to at Tulsa Hurricane to follow on Twitter. They can also go to, I think it's uh, High Octane Tulsa. I'll double check that. Um, tell us a little bit more about your social media campaign, what you're doing on Facebook. Well, we have Facebook, we have Twitter, we have the University Athletic website. Um, so all of those are ways to stay connected when you're not coming to the games. The best way to, is to come to the games and meet the players and meet the coaches. Because we are the smallest Division One school, we really encourage fans to come down to the field or come down to the court after the games and visit with the players, visit with the coaches. You know, we can do some things that some of the larger schools can't do, and we want to try to capitalize on our unique small campus and the friendly atmosphere that we try to promote. And if people want to go on the website, what's the website address? TulsaHurricane.com. All right, and I just looked it up just to make sure I was correct, and uh, let's see. Yes, it is at Tulsa Hurricane, and also at High Octane Tulsa. You can get all the coaches scoop, you can get the football scoop, and you know, you've seen me on my Blackberry, I lovingly oh. call us Crackberry, you know. I'm gonna set it down now, and uh, it is I, an addiction. It is an addiction, <laughs> isn't it? But people can catch you on social media, they can catch you on the website, and of course they can catch the games right here in this lovely stadium. It's a great place to watch a game and we do want people to connect with us when they're not here but the number one priority is to come to all the games. It's great activity, it's great entertainment and uh, really helps our programs and makes the student athletes feel really welcome to this community. Well I love coming to the games that's for sure. Well Bubba thank you so much for talking with us. Thank you it's great to be here and uh, we hope to see you at plenty of games as well. Oh I'll be here all right and we're gonna go to commercial break be back in just a minute. So you're from Tulsa what do you like about the city? Um, first of all, that everything is so convenient. I just came from California and everything was so spread out. Um, you can get where you need to go pretty much really fast. So the mall's close and everything like that. Mm -hmm. 